So some of the most exciting work that I've done recently is using mobile radar data to look at observations of tornadoes and particularly looking at the evolution of the rotation of those tornadoes with time and with height. Traditionally, the top-down hypothesis where the tornado forms in the cloud and develops kind of slowly from the cloud toward the ground has been more conventionally adopted. What we have discovered regarding the bottom-up or the non-descending hypothesis is basically in order to get a tornado to form, there is a series of conditions that have to be met between the storm and the physical ground barrier below. You have to have that upward motion, but you also then have to have this area of low level, very near surface rotation that's present too. If one of those two elements is missing, the tornado is not gonna form. The way this work kind of fits into the context of the bigger picture, having an understanding of the bottom up process and the fact that that's what's happening, allows us to now fine tune our further scientific studies to try to identify the sources for that rotation. If we can identify the sources, then maybe we can identify what characteristics of the storms are capable of producing the conditions that are required to make these tornadoes when that tornado is most likely to occur.